Hey y'all, how's it going? Hey, uh, I was wanting to uh, talk about one of the latest technologies in our industry and see what y'all think. Here, uh, I know I have my ideas and thoughts about it, but I want to see what a lot of other people think too, see what kind of, um, I don't know, opinions and everything that we have with concerning both sides of this issue and that's the uh the new dallin uh afb bees the uh the ones that have been uh immunized and stuff so here uh i know i've i've seen quite a few advertisements uh probably a month or two ago they had there was a lot of advertising going on from dallin and here uh Dallin had quite a bit of information on their website and there was a couple of things like just in general over the years I have been kind of uh I've always been really careful about what vaccines and stuff to use even in us you know um but like with the bees and everything here uh I got onto their website and stuff and you know they're explaining about afb and everything and you know um i haven't been beekeeping that long but uh i've it was rare that i've heard of anyone you know seeing afb and uh so when i was reading on their website that 50 percent of the beehives have afb spores in them and that kind of, I don't know, that, that rung with me. Uh, it's like, man, if the bees have, you know, 50% of the hives already have AFB spores, then, you know, what is it the bees are doing naturally on their own to keep from letting those spores get out of control and take over the hive? Well, um, one of the main things about the uh you know with vaccines and stuff is once you go through a few generations with a vaccine what that does is that takes well it doesn't really take anything away from any kind of gene or any kind of strain or anything but what it does is it covers up the weak part of that creature okay we're talking about bees right <laughs> so um so right now naturally the bees have a very good if 50 percent of our hives have afb what is their success rate right now at holding afb back it's very very high it's over 99 percent so i'm not sure why they made a vaccine for afb because uh, that's like, man, it is no problem. <laughs> so, so that was kind of funny. But um, if, uh, tell me what you all think about this. Because uh, me, I am definitely like, if you have a center line, and if this way is four AFB Bs, and then this way is not for it, and if we have like a 75%. I'm like 85% to not have it. And like I don't really want that strain in my line. Because that's going to mask the weak hives in my bees. You know. So that's where I'm at with it. And uh, well if y'all could just. You know we could start a discussion in the comments. And see what everybody thinks. And because that's what I'm all about. Here I'm all about talking about this stuff and because it just, once the bees grabbed a hold of me, they just got my interest and now I go down all these rabbit holes. So, all right. Well, y'all have a good one. We'll see you.